Yo, quick PSA before the video starts. This is <clears throat> my last ever recorded game. Full stop. There's no more Apex Legends. There's no more PS4 videos. Uh, there's nothing left. <laughs> I restarted my PS4. I'm selling it for real this time. And I'm just I'm just focusing on work more. Uh, I'm, it's kind of ironic to say, but I'm not good enough at the game. Despite this being like an 18k or 4,100 damage video. First level 4k. Uh, and then, uh, so close to the Tony Bomb, so annoying, but, yeah, I, I, I'm not good enough to go pro, I'm not good enough to do anything with the game, it's just a waste of time. I'm sure if I played a bit more, I would get better games as time progressed, sure, but I believe, I know, like, I know I'm done with the game, you know what I'm saying, guys, I'm 7,000 games in, I've been playing since season 3, uh, I could have played more. Like season 17 I played like a thousand games, 985 games and shit, 986. So I played a thousand games per season, I would be you know, on like you know, 14,000 games, no, 19,000 games, which, mean, which would mean I'm a lot better player, but that's a huge time investment, which I'm not prepared to do. I was doing like 12 hour days, 8 hour days, playing Apex like it's my job. And I'm like, I don't want to tell you guys, it's not good enough. Uh, I'm conceding, I'm conceding the truth. I'm, I'm very bad at the game. Like most games I just drop in, you know, I get a gun, I, I, I aggro a squad, I kill two, and the last guy, I just, most games are just that. The last guy I just die in the stupidest way, and then a third player rolls up, and even if I do kill him, I get a triple kill. I, I die immediately after, you know what I'm saying? And I watch guys like Fade that, get, that have 130,000 kills on his, on his main wraith, and I watch guys like Fade that, you know, 21 4k, he drops, he drops it like it's nothing. He doesn't even feel like emotion is for happiness when he drops it anymore. It's just, I, I just think to myself, like, I can't keep up. I'm too old for this shit. You know what I'm saying, guys? Well, it's, and also, it's a time I spend. You might, it might sound like I'm fucking, you know, I'm just like an old man, or whatever. It's the truth. It really is. It's the depression truth. Um, it might seem like, you know, 99% of gamblers, for, <laughs> for they don't win big and they stop gambling or something like that. No, bro. I'm, no, I'm, I'm not. No, I'm not good enough for that shit. It's over. <sighs> Sorry. Moving on, I have a few more projects I would like to complete. Before I got a God of War project, I have a bit more of other projects. I have other games like um, the we make and Roblox and stuff. And I'm building my gaming PC soon. It's not, it's not, I say it's a gaming PC, but not even a game PC because well, I want to use it mostly for work anyway. So. Yeah, that's it. That's, that's the final way to enjoy the video, guys. Peace. Hey, guys, I'm doing this just for, as a separate video. I'm not going to put this in the final video. I'm just doing this as a separate video to add on into the final game PSA. Because I was talking to my friend about this, how I like, I tried to restart my PS4. I started putting it up online so I could sell it. And uh, I told him the, the, the honest truth. And I, and I said, like, but what's the point of playing video games if you're not good at video games? And what's the point of playing video games if you don't, don't enjoy the, the video game? Like, I have, I'm a very competitive individual. I have a very, like, sh like, strong baseline on what I would consider enjoyable. And that is if I'm good or not. If I'm actually competent or not. I, f I think a lot of young men feel this way as well. I don't know, who, what, what type of guy just, like... Men at... Their baseline are competitive individuals. When you get to you see a guy with a 21 4K in Apex, you're like, holy shit, that guy's good at the game. I'm going to avoid that guy or I'm going to try to kill him or punch him off spawn. Right? Or you might well leave the fucking lobby because you see like a fool with like a triple predator, a three stack, uh, you know, them motherfuckers. Like the no life TTVs that get like 100 views per stream that have no, they make no fucking money off the game, but they're extremely, extremely good. Them motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying, guys? I, in my opinion, like, what's the point of playing the game if I, if I don't, like, if I don't play like that? Like, I can't play just to fuck around. I can't play just to mess about and burn time. Like, I need to feel like I'm achieving something. If I'm not achieving anything, like, getting a high kill game, getting a high damage game that I can turn into a YouTube video that will get hundreds of views, thousands of views maybe, then what the, what the flip is the point of me continuing to play the game? I'm just wasting my time. I'm not good at the game. I, I, I can use discipline to keep playing. Sure, but even that becomes difficult at some point because, uh, like, there's no this, there, there's no like, there's no 100% discipline in my opinion. Even when even when it comes to self improvement, I think there's always going to be a good balance between discipline and 
uh, motivation. It should be like 80-20, 80% discipline, 20% uh, motivation. Those one, two games that you get like high kill, high damage, those should be your motivation to keep playing. And uh, you should use discipline for the majority of it because Apex Legends is a very, very difficult game. Even Fade, like the best player that I compare myself to, um, I compare myself often, or Ecstasy, or like, you know, how any of these guys I compare myself to. Like, these individuals, they still, like, they still have their fair share of bad games, sure. But, like, I'm not how, I'm not Fade, I'm not Ecstasy, I'm not streaming, I'm not making money off this shit. I got banned on Twitch. <laughs> I don't even know what the reason is, I don't care. Like, I got banned on PS4 on my main account. I'm using an old account that's linked to my fucking... Main account when it comes to stats and, like, badges and stuff. So I'm drinking my smoothie. I'm not good enough at the game in order to become more like in order to constitute myself as one of these individuals. I'm not good enough. And I don't enjoy it, and I hate it. In fact, if anything, and it's a huge waste of my time, and I have other priorities to do. Like that, that's why I quit. I, I don't like. I have like literally no ability to go back. I mean, I do technically, but when I sell my PS4 along with the games, I have zero ability to, to go back. Straight up. No, like nothing. And I would rather it be that way, so I can focus on other things. I'm building my PC anyway. I could probably reinstall Apex again on my PC and I link out my accounts and everything, but yeah, I have no intention, straight up. I have zero Madeiro intention. I will never ever return to Apex ever again. And <sighs> yeah, I'm done. I'll probably never return to Apex ever again. So when I say that's my last ever game, I really mean it. It's my last ever game. Like I, I, I'm not, I'm not good enough. That game, although like it's kind of hypocritical, me, uh, critical of me to say because on my channel there's a lot of, like high damage games. There is some high kill games. Um, most of it isn't like in the in like in you know the mixtape, which doesn't even count anyway. Like the one that counts is like in in pubs and stuff, normal pubs, normal rank game, which I don't get. I don't get. I'm just straight full stop. Like point blank, I'm not good enough. It, I was talking to my friend before about this. And he said, "But you're still better than like, the majority of players. You're still very, very, very above average." Yeah, I am, but not good enough to my own standard, and that's all that matters to me. You know what I'm saying? Like for me, like my my average game goes like this: three kills, five kills, kill leader, maybe two thousand damage, and then I die in the stupidest way, and then like I like I have to restart all over again. Every single game goes like that. I got countless two Ks. Countless 2.5 Some 3Ks Like a few handful of 4Ks Like what is this bro I should be getting 3Ks minimum I should be getting 4Ks minimum And people hear, like, people they hear me say this And like you're crazy But that's like That's the mindset That's the mindset why I'm better than you for the mo Probably for the most part That's the mindset it's like That contributes to why I'm, I'm mostly I'm, I'm probably better than the majority of, play a majority of uh, players But being better than the majority of players Isn't enough like, I want to be, like, good, you feel? And if I'm not good, then, like, it's it's so hard to keep playing because it's so, such an unenjoyable hodgepodge, like, shithole mess, like, of playing. I'm going to put some Fade gameplay on this video so you guys, like, understand the levels in between. Like, Fade is probably, arguably, one of the best um, solo players of all time, straight up. Because he's consistent, like he always, like um, obviously he puts in the fucking hours. He has thousands of games per season. Like season seventeen was the game I, I was the season I actually like start grinding the most. Where I had like nine hundred eighty six, nine hundred eighty seven games uh, in season seventeen. And lo and behold, I had my best performance in those um, in that season. Getting three Ks, fumbling some three Ks, you know, getting four K. But I, I, yeah, after like the break, the break just took too much out of me. Like I, at that point, I realized like yeah, I can't afford to take huge breaks on Apex, and Apex isn't paying my bills, and Apex isn't like contributing to a happy, healthy life of mine. So what's going on? I'm not fame. I'm not a high kill, high a consistent high kill, high damage player. I have a high kill, high damage player. But I'm not consistent enough with it. That's why I believe Fade's the best. No, AC versus Fade, not even close. Fade will just literally nine times out of ten will smoke him. I don't know. I don't know if, if you guys. I don't know if you guys like know anything about that. I think other some other guys, some other like fucking guy who was like wasn't really that good at the game. He told me like he didn't have like two K. I asked him, did he have two K? Nope. I'm like what the fuck? Like, you were horrible. Stop playing. It's uninstall. Honestly, like 
you you know I know I know concretely if I'm good or not, and I think I'm not good enough. I have oh, nearly ten thousand games. I have seven thousand games on Apex. I have less than a thousand wins, so that's fucking horrible win rate as already. Uh, back to the aid fa ASU Fae thing. He told me that ASU's ASU's better. Like, no, he's not. Like ASU's like the OG. He's the clean movement and everything. But Fade, he's consistent. He's very hard to play against. He consistently shits on accomplished pros. I remember he fought Rogue's uh, Energy Rogue. I think uh, Rogue left Energy. A Rogue squad. He fought A Barelli. He fought, you know, um, there's some other, other like very highly accomplished pro professional players like like them TSM motherfuckers. And he beat them. He beat them solo in like in like a, in a solo queue. So uh, he a Fade is by far the best. And just to get like 10% of Fade's like ability is very high already. But I don't think I've even like scraped 10%. I haven't even begun to like scrape like what, uh, the echelons and what I'm capable of. I'm sure, like 200% sure, if I grinded as much as them, 8 to 12 hour streams every single day, you know, I would hit, my gym, hit the gym in the morning or I would hit the gym late in the night. And then I just wake up, turn on the PS4, or wake up, turn on the computer, and then I start like streaming, playing games. I don't doubt in my heart I, I would be very, very good at the game. However, I am not prepared to do like I'm not prepared to have that level of how do I say this contribute not contribution time effort time contribution um, dedication I think is the, the word I'm not prepared to have that level of dedication something that, that to me has like no visible reward. Straight up, I'm not good enough at the game. I've tried very hard, but I think I think I'm over. I think I think it's a good time to retire. It's kind of sad of me when I say that, but like, like I say it like that. But yeah, I think it's, it's I'm, I'm done. I'm finished. Hope you guys enjoyed the final video. I'll turn it into a video for um, the main channel. Edit it up, and everything. Add text. <sighs> but yeah, I'm not crying or anything. It's just, it's just got stuff nose, block nose. I'm just not good enough. I'm not prepared to get good enough. I, I don't want to. I don't. I don't want to. Like, it's not worth it. To me. Like a character, I really like. It plays fuse. I really like fuse. Fuse is very shit. But he's like a B tier, B tier, C tier legend at best. But I, I, I could get good at fuse. I could, I could get twenty-one four k with fuse. I could get triple pred with fuse if I really tried to. I could get ten thousand kills with fuse. Sure. Would it take a long time? Yes, it would. Would it take a few seasons? Yes, it would. But is it worth it? No. Straight up isn't. It's not worth it at all. Like what? Is the least worth it? Like. Uh, Profession, esports, gaming—I've seen like ever. It's the least worth it. The amount of money in it. Solo rewards are so low. It's so weak. Satisfaction and fulfillment that I get from it personally is very, very, very low and weak. It isn't worth it. Full stop. Period. That's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the final video. I'm gonna edit it up uh, now. I'm editing some other stuff, project I'm doing, and getting busy with other other stuff, all the courses I'm doing as well. All I have left the same. Stay safe. See you in a bit. Peace.